Just four. And a good start in terms of runs. 42, going at seven and over. But they've lost the two wickets, and that will be a problem for them. Two top order players, an ideal opportunity to score runs, get a big score, and they've missed out. It's wide of the off stump, and once again, good form from the New Zealand batsman, and good placement, four more through the covers. Come on there. Uh, Someone of six, but has lost his line, and he's an opportunity outside the the off stump and of course the uh, batsman love it it's gone finer no. that one is driven and it is signed well also i think the fielder just a shade late to start and that's four more runs signaled by venkatragwan well it's poor bowling this it uh, has no connection with international cricket at all really at the top level oh. it's uh, a bit of club bowling at the moment down the pitch and he's found the gap nicely in the field it's a very quick outfield and that's going to run away for four runs oh that was beautifully timed he might have had a heavy fog in the bit of dew around this morning but the outfield is quick yeah well executed shot this for a number of reasons the footwork is good that's the first point to look for a little shimmy down the track and the timing is good. The placement had to be perfect. Quite a strong onside field, and it was. He collects it this time. And at the old time, Roger Poo's up to New Zealand 100. As well, he cracked up this time. It was a full toss. It's the last trip. Very strong the left side, and I think. Well, you see that spotted a gap out there. He's got his half century. And as Richard had, he's been telling you, we've almost not noticed a single stroke until this last whack of a full toss through square. But uh, there'll be four more. That was a good shot. I was just about to pay a compliment to Salim to say he's pushed the ball through a little bit more realistically. And uh, yet the a very good shot, but like lightning to the deep square leg boundary. Pussy keeper, bowling to Roger too. Gets him away, down towards uh, deep backward square leg, by sixing square leg and long leg, four runs, 200 goes up on the board for New Zealand, 202 for four. Getting the length right is vital when you're playing the sweep shot. On this occasion, Roger Tews does get it right. He's able to get over the top of the ball. And it's a very well-executed shot. He drags it from outside off stump, hitting against the spin. 204 of just 214 deliveries. The innings have so far lasted 145 minutes. Changes in the field, adjustments. What was that? It's coming down to third man. And it's going to be four runs. In the last reverse sweep New Zealand played with Craig Spearman's. That didn't work. This one did from Roger Tews. He gets himself into position quite well. Just the grip on the bat early on. And he plays it with some confidence. Well, that's gone straight up in the air. He has to be out here. And he is. So two goes for 92. Gets the top edge. And another New Zealand wicket is down. Yes, the sweep shot always has an element of risk if you don't sweep the right length. But in this particular case, it's the left arm bowler who's actually slanting the ball across towards his off stump and outside. Top edge. The schoolboy lesson didn't see it against the spin. Uh, didn't quite apply there, but he's just swept across the drift of the ball. Two goes for 92, New Zealand 228 for six. 